Chapter 140, Spider vs. Earth Dragon Alaba 3. In the slow motion world of thought acceleration, I grasp the future's image that Foresight shows, the future where Alaba activates magic. When it becomes the monster of this class, it can use magic normally. The arch was the same too, and it means that I ha that, it, that I has the wisdom to do it. Naturally, there's no way in existence with such a wisdom will use magic that's more inefficient than the breath without thinking. Evade. A sharp spear of soil spring up at the place where I was a while ago. It's a soil version of the darkness spear. If I'm not mistaken, was it Earth Magic Level 3 Earth Spear? But in contrast with the darkness spear that's the type that shoots towards the opponent, the earth spear changes the ground of target point into spear suddenly. If I stayed there, I was about to become a skewer. The troublesome point of the earth magic is that it had the magic effect of the soil attribute added to it, and also has physical destructive power. Although it looks plain compared with fire and water, the troops state that it th is that it's a mixed attack of physical and magic. Speaking of the height of resistance, I don't receive any damage from ordinary magic. But when it comes to f m comes with physical destructive power, the story changes. Did Alaba foresee that I will evade? New Earth Spears appear one by one. As might be as expected of having the precise magic manipulation, the magic construction speed is impressive. Well, it's inferior to me, though. Such magic won't hit me who make full use of thought acceleration and foresight. But Alaba also understands such thing. Alaba's true aim is to eliminate my escape. I continue avoiding the magics, guided skillfully to a place, and at that place, the wall of soil is already surrounded in three sides. In addition, a wall springs up instantly at the entrance where I entered, Earth Wall of the Earth Magic. The only place that I can escape after being surrounded all directions is up. And on top of that, the appearance of Alaba, who has already released its breath. There's only in one instant before it hits. Evasion is impossible, if it's the normal. Transfer. I transfer to Alaba's overhead again. Darkness bullet to the head while it's releasing its breath becomes a second time. A hit. A scene, same as a while ago, as it developed, is developed right under me. The different thing from a while ago is that Alaba flew up into the air. The falling Alaba. A pursued darkness spear. But Alba regains its balance just before colliding to the ground, kick the ground with a light feeling and avoiding the approaching darkness spear. Ahead of avoiding it, the waterfall of poison rains down. The waterfall of poison that's made by maximizing the creation amount of poison synthesis and activate it continuously. Alba blows off the waterfall of deadly poison and paralysis with one breath, the splashing water of poison. Although it didn't e it didn't expect any damage, something like blowing it off with one breath easily I <laughs> wah. Al Alaba releases its breath towards me, who is in the air continuously. I make full use of space maneuver to avoid the anti-aircraft fire. Incident incidentally, I make a net with universal thread and fire it with the shoot skill. <laughs> That's right, I have acquired my heart's desire shoot skill. I mean, it was derived when throw reached max level. Well, it consumes MP, and because its level is low, it don't have much speed. To be frank, throwing it with throw is better, but this is the problem of feelings. The thread that's shot hardens like a ball, and I use the power of thread manipulation to open it into a net in front of Alaba. Alaba avoids the net grandiously, with the full exposure of its wariness, because it remembered that it got wounded by the thread a while ago. That reaction is not wrong. Although the thread just now is endowed with offensive ability, the true nature of the spider thread is to catch the opponent. I gave full adhesiveness to the thread that I used this time. Even if it's Alaba, it's not easy to escape if it got caught in this thread. If it's cautious of my thread to that extent, it's convenient for me. I scatter threads from the air. Alaba hates it and it avoids and repels it with one with the breath and comes to eliminate me who's the original source. Alaba who approaches to my location with space maneuver. Yes, welcome! The threads that seem to be scattered haphazardly. They're all connected by a thin thread that's hard to be seen. The thread that becomes the root is all in my foot. I haul a bunch of threads with thread manipulation all at once. At the same time, I shoot a darkness, darkness bullet to Alaba. The spider threads that approach, approach from the back, back, the darkness bullet that approaches from the front. If it avoids the darkness bullet, the threads will catch up. If darkness bullet is not avoided, it will receive damage. Which will Alba choose? Alba chose. A different choice. The breath offsets the darkness bullet. It changes forward during the aftermath. Crap. I barely avoid the approaching fang attack. I graze it a little and my satiation HP stock decreases. That was close. I almost failed to avoid because I'm holding the thread. Because I'm pulling a lot of threads, of course my movements will be limited. Even if it's transfer, if the magic is not made beforehand, it won't make it in time. So if it's a situation like just now, it can't be used. The reason why I seem to easily avoid my opponent's attacks with transfer is because I can make full use of thought acceleration and foresight. I foresee the opponent's action with foresight, and I begin the magic instruction instantly with thought acceleration. It seems that if that I transfer at once, but I actually prepared beforehand. Ava's action a while ago was a little unexpected. Thread or darkness bullet? I thought that it would pick either one. It looks like it was still underestimating. I was still underestimating Alaba. I motivate myself again. Both Alaba and I still have composure. The fight still continues. 
Oh shit. I mean, it's, it's fucking dragons putting up a fight. <laughs> Tell you that much.